Hello guys, this is Amos Doll Music and in today's lesson I'm going to teach you how to play Modus by Joji. I'll be teaching you how to play that piano instrumental that plays throughout the start. It's pretty nice, very relaxing, it goes like this, give you a preview. the last two parts again. Alright, so it's pretty awesome. We'll break it up into four parts that's easier to learn. So we're going to learn the melody and block chords because from that you can add all those improvisations and decorations afterwards, okay? Everything is based off the melody and chords. Alright, so Right hand, first part starts on the F sharp up here. Middle C, go up an octave C, up to the F sharp. Goes F sharp, E, D, down to B, A, B, B, D. That's it for the first part for the right hand. Let's do it again. So it goes F sharp, E, D, down to B, A, B, B, D. And that's it for the right hand. Left hand, four, uh, three chords here and two bass notes. So it goes like this. The three chords are E minor, which is E, G, B. Second chord is B minor, which is B, D, F sharp. Third chord is C major, which is C, E, G. And then two bass notes is C, D for the last two elements. All right, so yeah, the three chords, E minor, B minor, C major, and then two bass notes, C, D. Remember that. So with that, five elements in mind, the turns together goes like this, F sharp and E minor together. After D, B minor by itself, right continues. After the B, C major by itself. Two bass notes by itself. Like that. That's it for the first part. One more time. So it's together. Yeah. Yeah. That's it for the first part. Moving on to the second part. Right hand continues. Goes F sharp, E, D, down to B, A, B, 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 up to A, G, F sharp, E, D, like that. One more time, it goes F sharp, E, D, B, A, B, 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 up to A, G, F sharp, E, D, that's it for the right hand. Left hand, we just have the same three chords as the first part, but with no bass notes, it's just E minor, B minor, and C major. You know these three chords already, based on the first part. With that in mind, the two hands together, it goes like this, F sharp and E minor together. After D, B minor by itself, right continues. After B, C major by itself. That's it. One more time. It goes together. Yeah. Yeah. That's it for the second part. So yeah. Back to back the two parts of learned so far. We play like this. Moving on to the third part, third part right hand continues, goes F sharp, E, D, D up to the high B, and then octave below B, B, A, B, B, A. That's it. So for the right hand one more time, it goes F sharp, E, D, D up to B, and then goes B, A, B, B, A. That's it for the right hand. Left hand, four chords here, four different chords. So the first chord is A minor, which is A, C, E. Second chord is E minor, E, G, B. Third chord is G major, which is G, B, B. And then the fourth chord is an interesting chord. This one is four notes. It goes F sharp, A, B, E. These four notes. All right? Yeah. But yeah. Uh, remember these four chords because these last two parts have these particular four chords. Okay? So A minor, E minor, G major, and then the interesting F sharp, A, B, E. All right? Yeah. With that in mind, two hands together goes like this, okay? So, F sharp and A minor together. Up to D, E minor by itself, right continues. E major by itself, right continues. And chord by itself, right continues on the A. 
That's it for the third part. One more time, let's go together. Yeah. 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 Yes. All right, so back to back, the three parts of Lone so far will be play like this. Moving on to the fourth and last part here, right hand goes F sharp, E, D, D up to B, down to B, A, B, B, up to G, F sharp, E, D. So it's actually pretty much exactly the same as the previous part, but just instead of the last A, it goes up to the G, F sharp, E, D, at these four notes in, right? So everything else is the same, the left hand chords is the same as the third part, so with A minor, E minor, G, A, and the interest chord. Alright, so yeah, it's just like this, so this fourth part goes together. Yeah. 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 Four notes. Like that. So yeah, really similar as the previous part, just to replace the last A note of the previous part with the four different notes. G, F sharp, E, D. All right? So together. Yeah. 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 And that's it for the fourth part. So yeah, back to back all four parts of this lesson will be played like this. Yeah, so once you get the melody and chords all good, you can start to add your own improvisations to make it more interesting. Okay, just can keep it simple because the original is not that big of like a improvised version of it, okay? So yeah, uh, you can just do like simple like Alberti bass for the, like the chords, like do that as well. Yeah, and then if you want to be more ambitious, you can do like more like octave and arpeggio patterns on the chords. Really up to you, okay? And then the right hand you can harmonize the bass on the chords to make it a little bit thicker in texture, more lush harmonies, but still based off the like uh, harmonies of the chords itself, okay? So you can be like, Yeah, play around with it. Pretty nice theme. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed this lesson. Very beautiful uh, piano instrumental by Joji. Once again, a lot of great songs by Joji. I've done a lot of piano tutorials on Joji songs and Filthy Frank. There's a lot of great songs to learn. So just search up your favorite uh, Filthy Frank Joji song on my channel, followed by Amos Doll in the search bar, YouTube search bar, and you can find those lessons to learn for yourself. But as for now, that's pretty much it for today's lesson. If you enjoyed this lesson, make sure to check out the rest of my channel because literally there are multiple thousands and thousands of these videos ranging from pop songs of all languages, meme songs, video game music, movie, anime and cartoon theme songs and many more songs of all sorts that I teach. So most likely you can find your favorite song to learn on my channel. Also check out my website, bestpianomethod.com, linked in the description below if you want to learn more piano from me. Learn from my piano courses on how to play by ER, improvise, read sheet music, how to play and sing, and many more courses at all types of levels, even for those who have never touched a piano before. As for now, enjoy your time around my channel and see you next time.